What up, y'all? This weekend, I got into Aunt Jackie's grade C collection. I just finished shampooing and conditioning. Now, usually, I skip shampooing to avoid stripping my hair. But Aunt Jackie's Power Wash shampoo in this collection was so good to my hair. It left my hair clean. As you can see, I have no residue. Now, the conditioner is named The Rescued, and it did just what it says it does. Yes, the consistency is thick and creamy, and you can smell a good amount of ingredients. Like, you know, when you open apple cider vinegar and the smell is like fresh and inviting? Yeah, that's what the conditioner did for me. Rescued has grapeseed oil and castor oil, which are great treatments for your hair. I'm beginning by separating my hair into three sections for a crown flat twist and a finger detangle wash and go in the back. Now it doesn't matter how many times you have to keep going over that part, part it like Moses, keep going over it. Do not play with your parts. I know a lot of people struggle, but one day grab a wig and just manipulate it. Go crazy, go stupid, do triangles, squares, zigzags, part a whole circus if you must. Try not to manipulate your own hair though. All right, let's get it, y'all. I'm beginning to detangle my curls with the Frizz Patrol setting mousse. I'm a big fan of mousse. This one was lightweight and so far isn't weighing my hair down. It smells like heaven too. <laughs> you wanna be consistent on the amounts you put on each side. I like my hair to be very foamy, but a little goes a long way. You do not need to pump more than four times. Now, this Ice Curls Curling Jelly is the truth. I will definitely be revisiting the jelly. It wasn't sticky or watering, and I, I'm definitely gonna use it for a future wash and go. I really like this product. It had the right hole. You'll see my curls start to define quickly, and a little goes a long way for the jelly too. And the more you separate your strands, the more definition you'll see. Oh my, uh, my backdrop just fell, but now that my secret is out, yes, I am a broke college student. I might as well take the sheet down. It's fine, it's cool. Back to the money, though. The mousse and the jelly are P, B, and J, y'all. My hair is bouncy and voluminous. Also, my dry time seems shorter. As you can see on the side where I began, it's drying up real quick, so I'm not worried about any residue. A good mousse should absorb quickly, and that's exactly what's happening here. I'm living for it. I love it. To begin my crown, I'm going to do standard straight parts, but I'm going to curve them up to my edges. Remember to take your time on your part to do what you got to do to get it right. I'm going to go ahead and work this mousse. Oh, look at me. Clumsy as ever. A hot mess. I don't care. Y'all know y'all be a hot mess on wash day too. 
Don't act. It happens to the best of us. I'm now using slick styling glue to prevent flyaways on my flat twist. You want to use a tiny amount, heavy on the tiny, to prevent buildup. Always know that a little goes a long way. To begin my twist, I'm grabbing two strands and folding them over one another upwards as I continue to grab more hair after each strand. The mousse is giving my twist a good hold and preventing any frizz. I love it, I'm here for it, let's do it. If you're not a fan of wash and goes, you can definitely work this mousse into a two strand twist style. Look how stretch that mousse got my hair. I love it. Just keep twisting, just keep twisting, twisting, twisting. Hey, hey. Woo, the beauty. Do y'all see how glossy and defined that is? For super defined twists, whether they're flat, two or three strands, with a tight grip and consistency, do not get lazy. Your twist will look bomb. I don't know if you let up. Don't get lazy on your twist. Do y'all see how I'm making up my face because I'm twisting tight? Sad. Okay, y'all, I'm going to go ahead for two space buns now because I like a young and playful look. Now, I know I look a good, calm 13. I am not. I am 18. I am in college, and I am grown. <laughs> nah, I'm not grown, but I'm grown enough, period, okay?
I'm gonna go in with my Shine Ball Sheen Mist. I'm also a big fan of Sheen. I think that's just from all the years my mama sprayed olive oil in my hair. I wonder if any of y'all had that in y'all childhood. I think that's just our thing. But it's definitely satisfying to give your curls a lightweight shine. Also, this works without any oily feel, and I really like that. I don't really like a big oily feel to my hair. Overall, this was a great wash day using the Grapeseed Collection. I like this line because I could think of so many other styles I can do with this line. And that's the goal, to be as unique as you can possibly be. Thanks for watching, Frappes. If you like this video, be sure to subscribe and tap the bell.